Hey everybody, welcome back to some more CK2. Um, we don't have an answer on what happened last episode yet, because uh, this stream starts like half an hour after the uh, previous episode goes up. So we don't know yet if it's a glitch or an obscure thing that is ca causing uh, the weird war score where, that was weird, where as you can see from the green, the war score on occupation should be 100% for us, and it was almost 100%. Then suddenly, just after we captured one of the cities, boom, it went to really negative again. We have no idea why. Again, it's not a big deal if we do end up losing this war. The land they're taking for it actually isn't that amazing, and the goal, the uh, prize we get for winning it is quite poor. However, I'd like to win it. Uh... Da, 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 da. I just had the score thing happen to me. I had 70% advantage in battles and 100% advantage in siege, but was losing overall by 90%. I ended up using console commands to force win the war. Yeah, I'm not cheating. I was also doing an invasion. Yeah, I think there's a chance it's a glitch, but I think it's more likely there's a very obscure mechanic playing into this, and I'd love to know what it is. So... Oh, uh, first, this is actually my first time recording or streaming with this new headset that came in this morning. So it's going to be interesting seeing how different it might sound for me. And I might even um, talk a little different with this on, just because I'm not used to hearing uh, how I sound while I talk with these specific ones on. Because the backing here is not plastic, it's metal, and I've never worn a headset like that before. So I sound different. I might actually get distracted a little bit by how I sound while wearing this, because it's my first time using it. Uh, so, if I talk a little slow sometimes, it's because the own feedback of my voice that I'm not used to, sounding bassier than usual, is distracting me and causing me to lose my train of thought. So I apologize for that, but these just came in. Alright. Okay. You think there's more Red Things Don't Fan list? There are, but if you didn't catch the last episode, um, we had positive 80% war score, or about that. Then we took a province, their last one, their final one in all of Rome, the Papacy we have completely sieged. We took the last one, and then we jumped down to negative 95. So, us doing something good made a bad thing happen. So, no one knows yet. But we need to handle this, because there are a lot of troops in the area, and we don't have a whole lot of troops on us right now. Whereas there are enemies kind of around here-ish. They're not really sieging anything yet. Like, this is a host. I don't care that much about them. Um, our capital's perfectly safe, though. They're mostly just trying to take land in Greece, because that's their war goal. Although they own very little of the land that is actually part of their claim. So... Let them unsiege a province. That sounds like a terrible idea. So I'm going to move in, and I'm going to try and pursue their army. Ooh, that sounds much louder to me right now. Okay. Going to have to get used to that. Okay. People leaving. Right, what's my threat at? 80%. Okay, so we're going to drop below 75 before too long. We're sowing dissent, because I'm trying to get them kicked out of the war, or like a rebellion to stop them you're losing 19% war score from occupation Greece that is true but that doesn't account for the whole like 100% thing going on where we were about to win we have all of it and then just boom all of a sudden uh, Newmark tribe whatever that can recover on its own wow this really is much louder you can hear the little details much louder in this headset I might need to turn it down a little. If they unsiege a province, that might update the war score. That is not how the calculation works, I don't think. I believe it updates immediately on any change. Including every battle, it changes. So I don't think that would do anything. Um, What is this par uh, quest line a part of? Oh, I'm building an observatory. I forgot about that. Yeah, of course I'll pay the money. They're sieging that. That's fine. In fact, all they did was, yeah, burn the capital a bit. That's fine. OK. 
Okay, and I can recreate that if I want, but they're going to just ditch it again because they're over the limit. That's fine. I'm not going to spend money just for them to destroy it over and over. There we go. We won a battle. Although, uh, yeah, we got almost no war score for that because it was such a lopsided battle. Wish there was a way to scroll that list, but like Mouse Wheel and stuff does nothing there. Um, hmm. And this is all of his land sieged, right? Yes. Yeah, that's all of his land fully sieged. And all of it is sieged by me, right? Or do they own a little bit in here? Hold on. Their flag is that one. No, they don't any own any land in there. That blue glow was making me think that maybe, but no. They do not. Yep, it's all fully sieged, and all of the full siege is by me. Just double checking, though. I wouldn't mind dropping a little money to put some forts on this, actually, just to buy myself more time to stop them. You know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to build forts on all of these counties, so I have more time to respond if they're trying to unsiege something. In fact, I already put one on Rome. There. What do you have to do in this game? I think the chat can explain that one for you. It'd be weird for me to just suddenly explain it like a, a 200 episodes in. I hate that they siege trade posts, but in foreign lands, nothing I can really do about that. God, I wish uh, they didn't loot my capital so hard at that one point. That sucked. I'd really love to send a group over here to start uh, uncapping some of this, but I don't want to go ditching Rome, you know? Well, you know what? They don't have big armies in there. Ah, they're moving all their armies over there. Yeah, that's annoying. Twitch alerts are off, I saw, by the way. Yeah, my Twitch alerts are almost always off. I can see them on this other monitor over here, though. Uh, thank you for subscribing. Um, okay. I think I actually do want to raise a fleet and move over. Yeah. Right. I, I always forget. My best fleet is down here. I may as well just bring them in through that. Nope. Wow, we actually have a dangerous faction. We haven't had that in a while. Independence. Wow, it's been so long since we've had a dangerous faction be actually dangerous. It's probably just because my personal army is smaller than usual. Um, how much are we spending right now in updating our retinue? Okay, it's the it's it's quite a bit. It's like three thousand a year. Okay, that's that's the bulk of what we're paying then. That makes sense. Ooh. God, I've got some awful, awful pain in, like, upper neck, uh, like, between, top of between shoulder blades area today. Sucks. What are your views on the CK3 map? Uh, some people have said it looks good. Bear looks fun to me. All right, uh, I need to double check what my retinue cap is at. It's below cap, but not by much. Not worth spending the money on it right now. Okay, boats are almost here. I'm sorry, am I sieging something? What am I sieging? I own everything here. Oh, there's a foreign trade post here I'm sieging. Okay. Yeah, it's not worth anything. Their war score is just going up because of occupation again. So I want to uncap some of it. All right, this'll help. We'll see how this goes. They might just end up uncapping a bunch of their land. And that would be really annoying if they do that, but uh, there's really not anything I can do about it. 
I might peace out of the war just to get it over with because, uh, again, we were supposed to apparently win the war last time, but it just didn't happen and no one really knows why. Ambition to the Grand Prince, uh, economic tech points, learning prestige. Nice. Because of the state of the art laboratory. Oh, need a new spy master. Raiders right there. Yeah, the raiders are getting more aggressive because they can see that our troop count is low. Oop, nope, we need to import a uh, spy master. We need a better one. This one's good. There we go. And do we need to murder again? Yes, we do. Uh, who were we taking out? This guy, because he has tons of trade posts. Yeah, I think he's one that got inherited in from some of the land we took. Voice is amazing. Thank you. Okay, and we have a siege guy? Uh, yes. Yes, we do. We actually have quite good people on that. They have a lot of people very spread out right now. Mm. Conspiratorial faction, getting strong again. Kill the insurgent leader. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Who here has the most troops? I think it's the leader. Looking like it. Yeah. King of Poland. Hmm. I could threaten them. In an appropriate place. Huh. Near the unmarked tombs. I hope I can't die during that. Wouldn't surprise me if I could. I could probably murder him, though. Just might need to do some bribes? Yeah, bribe that guy. There we go. We uncapped a little land. They're just going after a bunch of forts right now. Yeah, they're trying to uncap some of the land we have on the Papacy. It, honestly, it might be a good idea to just peace out of this war so that we uh, make more money in the long run. All right, they actually have a lot of troops right there. We'll see how this goes. Okay, they have a lot right there, and I'm not happy about that. Yeah, the, the war score is still really fucked. We don't know what's going on with that. Mm. And again, their crusade is for Greece, so... They're just going for all this dark purple land. They don't actually own much of it, though. Is Byzantium your vessel? No, we just own most of their land. Nice. Right, for forgot we were working on that. That's nice. There we go. We've got that fully unseaged. We're gonna we're gonna take the island back. Because that way, if they want to actually stop me, they've got to land an army on me, and there's no way they'd do that. Yeah, they're trying to siege random pieces of land around the country. How's that murder plot going? Pretty good, but can I, uh, speed it up? There. Thanks for all the falls, everybody. I appreciate that.
I hate that we're not the leader of this siege. Okay, now we are good. Raiders, not in the capital, okay. What I care about most is that it's not in the capital. Throw him in the pit, he complained. Oh, okay, and the murder plot is going, good. Okay, that is unseaged. All right, their war score is going down fast as we're unseaging this stuff. And they're mostly sieging things not in Greece, which helps. Oh no, people know I murdered. Whatever. Think you also want to kill the leader of the Byzantine Revolt? No, I want to kill the Byzantine Empire at some, or Emperor at some point, but that's super low priority right now. We have other things to deal with. There we go. We've completely taken the island back, which is nice, because it is part of their claim. Oop, that's raiders in the capital. I don't like that. But I don't have any troops I can raise around here. Yeah. That sucks. I'd have to do mercenaries. That's expensive. But the capital is actually incredibly important to us. Yep. Yeah. God, that sucks. Okay, moving him to Newmark first so he's out of the diseased land. Uh, Marinery, duty. And evil duck, steward. Sieging seems like it's working. Well, yeah, we're unseaging the land that uh, they're trying to grab, and we still have them fully sieged, which is important. So we're making progress. They have a lot of troops, though, so it is worrying. They're mostly sieging land right now that is not part of their claim, though, so it's not really doing them much. Okay, that stuff that they're sieging there, they're probably insta-sieging that because we we only unseaged it frequent or recently. And so it's uh still not uh it doesn't have much of a garrison. Get drunk. What is this? Uh some kinswoman that I don't know died. Okay. Yeah, make a new friend, sure. Why do we only have 15k troops when our troop cap is like 60k? Because we're like 10 years into this war. It's been a crusade. It's kind of, you know, people die. There we go. Oh, I wouldn't be the leader of this siege. That sucks. Alright, do the murder. Alright, battle Stanton done. Disband the mercenaries. All that matters is we kept them from getting us too bad. Like plague status? I think it kind of receded. Yeah. Just a little smallpox down there. Slow fever, measles. Yeah, um, consumption up there. It never actually hit Europe. There we go. We're doing well. Are they finally going to start unseaging Rome, or are they deciding that Greece is more important? Because if I, if they were smart, they'd be going for Rome right now. China? What about China? There we go. He's dead. Oh, I got to turn off Flux. It's turning on. There we go. For us, sunset happens during the CK2 streams this time of year.